Let's use this tilted track to measure the force of gravity parallel to the track on this cart and then see how that force affects the motion of the cart over time. This cart system has a mass of 0.80 kilograms now and has a hook on the force sensor which will allow us to measure the strength of the forces on the cart parallel to the track. Let's collect data on the forces acting on the cart in a direction parallel to the ramp due to gravity. We'll now send the cart traveling up the ramp and record its motion for two seconds. These two graphs capture the position and velocity of the cart right before, during, and after it reaches the peak of its travel up the ramp. This was condition one. In condition two, we'll increase the mass of the cart to 2.30 kilograms, but keep the angle of the ramp the same. In condition three, we'll increase the angle of the ramp, but keep the mass of the carts the same as condition two. And in condition four, we will keep the angle of the ramp the same, but reduce the mass on the cart so that it is the same as it was in condition one, which was 1.80 kilograms.